Welcome back to Lunch Break. I'm Kelsey Hubbard. Syracuse besting top seed Indiana in a stunning upset last night. Our Wall Street Journal sports team has been all over the NCAA tournament and WSJ sports editor Jim Cherusmi joins me now to forecast the rest of the madness. It is ongoing. Hi, Are people Kelsey. getting any work done in these two weeks? I don't know, but we're, we're definitely t uh, watching the tournament as it goes. No. Big game last night, Indiana, right. Syracuse, uh, right. really a great well, thing to watch. Well, I know, uh, you know, being a journalist, you have to remain neutral, but I went to Syracuse, <laughs> oh, okay. so th that my alma Full mater disclosure. had a big game, right, had a big game <laughs> last night, I was a little excited, I don't know if I remained impartial or not, but um, <laughs> basically Indiana was one of the picks to win it all, a lot of people's picks, they're a top seed, third highest scoring team in the nation, they only scored 50 points last night, Syracuse played this 2-3 zone. zone that basically confused them, perplexed them. Now and, how did uh, that happen, I mean, they were watching video tape for days they prep for this but it really right. when it Appar came up to in person and live they just couldn't do right. it right apparently they never faced a team that played a zone which was confusing really? me. you know all season they basically were had this high flying team high scoring team they did not play a team that played the same defense Syracuse played last night and it just confused them so uh, you know they go home Syracuse moves on some people are happy I would say <laughs> <laughs> I would think so. So, I mean, that must have been a real interesting point when people were picking their brackets, though, to know that the, did they realize this team had never gone up against a zone de defense like that? Well, as you said, you figure they had a week off. So they, you know, they had time to practice it. But I guess, you know, uh, they... They just got out coached. They got out coached. They got out maneuvered. All right. So yeah. Florida Gulf Coast uh, is another one that people are watching. Right. A team that's sort of, you know, in the in the in well, limelight. Tell Florida Gulf them. Coast was a 15 seed. They've already blown everyone's bracket. No one had them going this far. <laughs> They're the first team, in fact, uh, to go this far as a 15 seed. So basically, that's the fun in rooting for them because basically, if you root for them, no one picked them. So everyone's bracket is ruined already. So, <laughs> but tonight I think it's going to end. They play Florida. Oh, okay. Uh, Florida play. Florida Gulf oh, Coast. Wow. I think Florida, the big, basically the small school playing the big boys, I think Florida is going to win. Now, why have they been able to really stay in it so strong uh, when nobody really realized that to begin with? What are they doing right? Well, they play an exciting brand of basketball. They're, they're nicknamed Dunk City. Um, they and they limit the other team to not dunking the ball. Okay. So basically, they upset Georgetown. They upset San Diego State. I think the run's going to end tonight. But it's it's worth watching. You know, it's a fun story, and it's, it doesn't even sound like a school, right? Florida <laughs> Gulf Coast. Great. <laughs> That's right. It sounds like maybe a retirement home. Spring break home. or, or spring, spring break, break yeah, destination. Whatever. Okay. So now we're going to take a look at Michigan against Kansas. What's a, right. a chance for an upset there? Right. Kansas is the top seed. They haven't played well. Michigan was struggling at the end of the season, but two wins in the tournament, similar to Syracuse, you know, they, they were in the top 10 most of the season. I think they're going to win. All right, and we've got Michigan State and Duke, which yeah, is always a Yeah, that's the game of the night, the two blue blood teams. Uh, you know, both teams are usually in the Sweet 16. It's going to be a fun game. I think it's going to be a good night for Michigan. I think Michigan State's going to win that, too. All right, so that's a look at where you are. How's your bracket doing? Can I ask you that? Uh, it's already ruined. <laughs> it's already ruined, so I'm rooting for Florida Gulf Coast. I think they're going to lose, but, uh, you know. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us. We Thanks. appreciate it. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be tuning in to see that, of course, around this office. Everybody's following it, so I'm sure you are, too. You can get much more from the sports team at WSJ.com.